Since Blazek, we should be recording now. It's your man Blazek. Are we gonna be doing something new, something different? We're gonna be playing through Sonic Frontiers on the Nintendo Switch. So this whole streaming thing is new to me, but I've always wanted to try it out. Um, let's start the software and let's go. So this will be a, a general playthrough. And this is the first time I've actually booted up this game. You know, Sonic was the first game that I got into. So I feel like it was only right to give this a whirl because it's kind of controversy. Uh, it's kind of controversial as well. So let's see what we have. Okay, it's looking good. Okay, we've got language. What language do we have? Okay. Uh, yeah, we leave that. Okay, let's go a new game. Let's go normal. Action or high speed? Okay. Action, this style is recommended for people who are not familiar with Sonic gameplay. High speed, this style is recommended for people who are used to Sonic gameplay. Okay, I'm going to go action, speed, action style because I'm not used to Sonic. I've barely played a Sonic game since uh, Sonic Adventure. So let's go. AI program now. <laughs> okay, Dr. Robotnik up to no good, as always. It's all coming online. The ancient secrets will be mine. Status report. Answer me. Simulations complete. Executing protective initiative. What? No! No! Track the Chaos Emeralds here, right? Let's find out what drew them here. Where's my man Knuckles? Okay, let me dim this down a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Oh, so we're going straight into it. Whoa. All right, let's see how it goes. Okay, it's B to jump. And A to jump. Okay, we're going straight into it. Let's go. Okay, I tried to move the camera. You can't move the camera in this section. Okay, speed ramp. Another speed ramp. Okay. 
Yeah. Looking good, feeling good. Uh, okay. Okay, let's try the home in. Okay, we bounce up, grind on the rails as always in the Sonic game, get the coins. Okay, you run into the question mark. How do you... Okay, so you attack with B. Still learning the controls. Okay, A will glide up. Whoops. Okay, so B is to jump. Okay, so Y is to do a homing attack. Okay, I'll get it. Let's go. Okay, I'm still learning, I'm falling down. Okay, we need some coins. Let's get some coins quickly. That's right. Yeah, man, this feels good. This feels good. Oh, nice loop to loop. Ah, oh, missed the coin. Okay. So I'm sure that was a bad time. D, okay. But we got thrown straight into it. With no uh, controls, we have the option to try again. Let's try again. I like how we're just thrown straight into it. So I can already see these levels being addicting, you know, going back and trying again. Okay. Need to rim to jump. Home effects. Okay, missed the coin, but that's okay. We can always come back, I'm assuming. I reckon a C. Yeah, okay, we can continue. I'm, I'm happy with that for now. But yeah, just an introduction. Playing on the Switch, playing with the Pro Controller, Sonic Frontiers, okay. Now first things first, people were complaining about the graphics but it looks pretty good to me. I mean it remains to be seen how the open world looks. Okay, I guess the rain doesn't look too great. Tails? Amy? Oh. Looks like I'm the only one who made it out of that. Whatever it was. Ooh. Mortal. Uh, hello? You have done the impossible. You have escaped cyberspace through your own power. You are the key. Key, huh? Sure beats being called a rodent. Are you saying I can rescue my friends? Find the Chaos Emeralds. Destroy the Titans. Tear down the walls between dimensions. Yeah, okay, sure. How about a little context? Hello? Oh well. 
Some direction is better than none. Here we go. Okay. So, okay, right stick to rotate the camera around. Okay, just like a Breath of the Wild, I guess. Press the left D button to bring up this window again. Cool. Okay, options to change camera style. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I guess the graphics do look a bit sketchy. But I mean, it's, it's, it's still usable. Okay, let's see. There are three ancient switches on the ground. Activating them will earn a reward and unlock a part of the map. Is that it? Okay. Complete challenges to reveal the map. Okay. But yeah, this can't be compared to Breath of the Wild in terms of graphical fidelity, man. Even the water looks... Oof. Kinda ugly. I wonder why it's just bad. Okay, nice little grind section. So if you didn't know, this game's been slightly compared to Breath of the Wild, the Zelda game. And notifications, press down while the notification display to practice the action. Okay, cool. Okay, press down. Okay, it's teaching us home and attack. So that's why. Okay, nice tutorial. Can be exited by pressing minus when minus is displayed. Press Y when the enemy cursor is displayed. Okay, that's the home and attack. Okay. He double jumps as well. Whoa, what's going on? We've got an enemy. Uh oh. Let's see what we need to do. Well, I know it's coming because I need my rings. When enemies are defeated, they drop various items such as skill pieces and seeds. Typical stuff, just pick up everything we. everything they drop. Try that again. A lot of little grind sections, which featured heavily in the um, uh, Sonic Adventure, right? But the graphics are rough. Okay, why are you attacking us, bro? What do you want, bro? Okay, let's try and beat them properly. Boom, the attack. Cool. Okay. Connect their stuff. Okay, cool. So the music says all tranquil, calming, but the graphics don't hold up too well, unfortunately. Uh, we break. Okay, we can break all these things. Okay, cool. Okay, nice. I like the flow of the movement, though. It's typical Sonic. Right, always moving. Okay. 
Yes, I like that flow. This is Sonic. Okay, let's see what's next. Ninja. Guardians are very powerful. They are bigger than normal. When an enemy is targeted, lock onto them by pressing the right stick. Okay. Oof. What's going on? Let's get some rings. Okay, similar to Age of Calamity, you need the right stick to lock onto them so you can stay focused on them. Okay. Cool. Look like a strong enemy. Oof. I'm kind of feeling the music though. See. All I know is as long as I have rings, I'm good. Over here, fam. Oof. Ooh. That was a long range attack. I feel like this movie's gonna get pumped up any time, any minute. I wanna hear some nice techno. Man's going ham. There you go. Some techno coming through. Kind of vibing the gameplay. Okay, almost there, one more hit. Okay, that's it. Guardians will drop a portal gear. These gears are very important, so don't forget to pick them up. Cool. Okay, so that opens a portal. Let's go. So first impressions, yeah. It's playable, but the graphics, man, it's a shame that the Switch had to look like this. But this flow movement, it looks good. Or it feels good, rather. Okay, so you might be wondering why Sonic Frontiers, right? Well, the first game that I got on the Sega Master System at the young age of six was Sonic the Hedgehog built in the into the Master System, you know. And so intermittently throughout, I've been playing some Sonic games, you know, Sonic 3, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, Sonic Adventure, Sonic Adventure 2. Um, that was in my teens and ever since yeah I've never played a, a Sonic game since then I know there's colours unleashed but I just haven't had the desire as it seems like Sonic games just start to lose their quality but I thought I'd give Frontiers a chance and especially as a good opportunity to play through it since it's a new game Okay, let's see, what's this about? Are there enemies as well? Uh, what do they want? Y and L. Oh, it's like a control, okay. Okay, it reminds me of a puzzle in Twilight Princess. We have to use the rod to control the statue. 
But yeah, man, the graphics are not good. What the hell did they do? I've never seen a Switch game that looks this rough. One of my favourite Switch games is Pikmin 3. And that was a Wii U game. And that looks much better than this. Sonic Sai Loop skill can now be learned. Use the skill points you have accumulated as shown in the lower right of the screen. Go to the skills menu to unlock it. Okay, so we've got level up things. Okay, we've got skills. Unlock Sai Loop. Let's do it. Hold X while moving. Run around while leaving a light trail. Okay, okay, let's try it out. Let's read in. Hold X, okay. Let's try it. So I like the tutorial though. You know, it's giving us a good... Nice. You know, a good intro to gameplay. All these apparatus and... Uh, you know. Motions. Let's see, maybe let's use our side, this is side loop. Okay, that's a straightforward puzzle. Okay, so more of the map. This is Kronos Island. Okay, we're heading to a blue Chaos Emerald. those rings so I reckon if it looks this bad on the switch I can only imagine PS5 Xbox it looks bad as well in comparison to most other games Let's grind. I like these camera angles though You know, I can imagine once you get used to the islands, you can probably just move with, with a, a lot of flow, a lot of motion. Okay, what are these? Try the side looping combat. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so hold X and go around it. Nice. <laughs> when an enemy is about to attack, a visual effect will appear running between Sonic and the enemy. What's the visual? The... Okay, so left, down. Just trying to find the skills menu. So Return this? to the digital dimension again. Okay. Use that gear to bridge the gap between dimensions. An activate portals can be activated with portal gears. Jump on that portal on the portal's pedestal to insert the pedestal. Let's go. Why? I always get confused with the Y and X on the Switch controller. Never got used to it. It is not enough to make the connection. Okay. One gear will not suffice. Hunt down another target and take its gear. Okay. What's going on? So I guess this is the other target. What is this? Dodge guardian attacks to dodge. Lock into an enemy with the right stick. And then press L or R. Dodging is faster than normal movement. And you're there, there's no need to lock onto an enemy. Okay, let's try it. 
Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, let's beat him up. Let's go. Oof. Okay, let's try that side loop. Oh, is he not? Okay. I'm getting my buttons mixed up. There we go. Go, go. Uh, get the rings, get the rings. Oof. What's going on, man? Might as well cycle. Go, 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 go. His health is going down, but it's losing its members. Ooh. Okay, it's going down for sure. Let's try and cycle. I'm in the music though. It's coming up so quick, 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 quick. Okay, nice. Let's go, let's go. It's going ham now, huh? Okay, so that dodge is more like a counter. Him now. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we've got a gear. Use the gear as you have done before. Okay, the action is getting pretty good. Okay, so hit Y. I'm assuming we go to back to that type of stage that we started Return out with. Return to cyberspace as many times as it takes. Okay. Another skill, boost wall. L and Z R. Boost wall. Okay. Execute consecutive actions. B. L near rings. And Y. Okay, it's teaching us. Y no. Omen attack cancel stomp. Okay, this is a deep oil. Cool. 
this is a pure tutorial, okay? No range. Oh, okay. Just push down that. Just push down the left stick. To, the, to run up walls. Okay. Uh, B, 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 B. Y. Y, A. Jump, Y, A. B, 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 B. L and R. Oh, quick step. Oh, Sonic's got a lot of moves in this game. Parry. Hold L and R. Prepare. Stomp in the air. Double jump. Okay, execute consecutive actions. Okay, so left. Push left stick. Boost jump. Hold X while moving. Yeah, we know this. Oh, this is all training. I could just exit. Dope. But it's good to know. Okay, this, this theme tune I've been digging. Because I've been hearing it in the trailers. Let's go. Oof. Yeah, I'm trying to remember all the skills we learned. Yeah, I'm feeling this music. Hey, no. Okay. Yeah, this music's so. Yeah, this is classic Sonic now. Okay, jump over the road. Oof. Cool. There's some red wings that I know we need to collect. But I'm just really blasting through it for now. Hopefully this time will be better than before. Okay, boost. Let's see, is that a C? Oof, D, okay. Let's give it one more shot. Let's go back to that cyberspace. You know, but I'm really digging that theme tune. And I think these little levels break away from the main action, so I like it. But it's all about keeping in motion, right? Let's go. Don't forget the home attacks. Let's go. Oof, good. Feels like a lot of buttons to remember. Bad where we start off. Okay, back there. Over. Okay, red rings there. Nah. These controls are a bit funny, bro. Okay, let's try again. We've obviously lost in 
improving stage time. That's cool. Okay, we got the red. Keep going. We can improve it later. Okay, so more training. Push that oh, up. Okay. Okay, so every time it loads, we train. I appreciate that. Oh, let's exit. So what do you guys think of the game so far? Got three vault keys. Sealed and can now be opened with a key. Okay, that's the blue chaos emerald. Okay, so the cyberspace stages seems to unlock more areas of the main map okay okay cool so i think i'm gonna leave the first playthrough over here you know we've done quite a bit we've learned quite a lot but what do you guys think of this game can it compare to breath of the wild do the graphics look good on switch i think they are a bit iffy but the game the gameplay is quite tight you know it feels like sonic uh, string and movements together for now I like it you know but let's call it a day here I'll save up here and then we'll continue where we left but for now it's your man Blizzak thanks for watching stay tuned for the next episodes peace